Okay, we continue MoGraph menu and reach to the fracture. What is the fracture? Uh, if you have object, as you can see, we have three objects that are, uh, it's a little sub object here, you can see. And bring them all um, under the null. And uh, if you want to use, uh, clone them and use the effector from them, you can use a clone. And as I said before, you if you clone them, the cloner sort them in a grid, in any option here. And you cannot, and if you don't want to clone the object, but if you want to use the effector on them, you have to use a bridge called fracture. If you click and drag and select them all below the child fracture, they maintain in their position, but the interesting part happened here. If you select a fracture, I explain the mode later. But if you go to go to effector, interesting part happened here. It means you can use the effectors by your objects in your scene. For example, I select the plane effector and its parameter, you can change the position of them. And in a plane, you can use a field on them. For example, a linear field. And as you can see, you can change the parameter of the position of the objects like this. Uh, if you go to the mode and the, the first mode is straight, it means in define the parent object and the child with underneath that in one object. But if you select it, like explode segment let's see what happened okay they are created both of them in this lesson uh, in this example you cannot define it i give you example don't worry <clears throat> with a with a, another uh, plane effector uh, so you can uh, use um, on the plane effector different parameter for example uh, rotation or scale for example the uniform scale you can make the negative number that you want and you can as you can see you can scale them and reverse them because um, in a plane i is negative one and then as you can see you can do it like this interesting okay so you can use if any effector with your object without clone them. That's it. <clears throat> uh, oh, oh, sorry, because I change it. First, go into the parameter and untick the scale, and after that, you can delete. Uh, okay, so you can use any parameter. Uh, uh, I explained the, all of the fields and before effector before you can please refer to the previous <coughs> video for example come and use another effector select the fracture and you can use for example random where is that formula on random in a position it's randomized in its uh, some angles here and in a random no no don't need to that for example change explode and as you can see in this mode it's explode segments we have uh, as you can see several objects and they're exploded in a straight they're calculating one object but in explode it's select explode the child segment and explode segment and connect for explaining this i give you another example for example a cube we have two cube holding control and copy them okay we have two cube if you select a cube as i said before in uh, parameter objects you can separate the faces and after that you if you make them editable and as you can see the faces are separated now okay and if you go to the MoGraph and uh, create a fracture of this, you can select all of the objects and then connect them. They are separated in internally, but before 
creating the select holding uh, your middle mouse button to select all the children with holding shift if you select this cube just the cubes will be selected you can select middle mouse button with uh, <clears throat> all the faces below and as you can see all the children's and now you can connect and delete make current connect object and delete and it's become one object but they are separate if you go to the face if you select it as you can see they are internally separate but one object if you select it. this situation if you bring this cube under the fracture the straight does not mean because it's calculate this object one object straight and here want to explode segment and connect mode it means if you set it in this mode and go to the uh, fracture if you select it you can select the for example the random in this parameter and go into the object explode it and as you can see you can explode a segment or you can explode segment okay and then connect them it calculate two objects and connect this object explode connect and it define uh, one object you can go to the random and for example a linear field the linear field is as you can see they are act like two objects as you can see you can rotate it if you want that's it as you can see uh, there are one object under the fracture but the software and a fracture when the mode is explode segment and then connect okay they explode them and define this as a one object because it does not connect to any object and connect it and uh, make a separate object but the explode segment just explode them just nothing and as you can see you can do it like this so explode objects fracture or mode okay this is on transfer you can change the color we have a display as i said before and here are effectors you can assign effector and in the effector you can control all fields and use the fields to create your own idea hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.